Hey y'all, welcome, welcome back to all my current subscribers. If you're not a subscriber, please hit that subscribe button to become a part of the Lakeisha Inspires family. So I'm sitting here um, and I'm watching my End Times Bible Teachers video. I'm re-watching it. And I thought about this before, I believe, but I, I don't know. But anywho, so she was talking about the nine-year-old that had the dream or you know um they had the dream she had a vision and she had uh she heard audibly from god and she said on october 10th but she didn't say a year that there was going to be a great earthquake and i find that very interesting because the great earthquake that I was mentioning and that we thought was going to happen on September 22nd did not happen. And I believe it was on September 24th or 5th when I decided to make a video and let you guys know what was going on um, that I heard in my spirit the eighth day and when my bible study teacher just brought it up about the earthquake and i was like yeah wow i was like that's probably first of all i don't think it's a coincidence that she's saying on october 10th there's going to be a great earthquake and that i heard the eighth day on the day that i was about to make the video in regards to what was going on and why we believe that the earthquake did not take place on September 22nd. And so that's not a coincidence. And I'm like, okay. He was probably telling me that day because when I heard the eighth day, I was on my way literally out um, going out my front door to make the video but I didn't understand what the Holy Spirit was trying to tell me and then now I see the video of the little girl um, um, that was shown that there will be a great earthquake on October 10th like I just feel like that is just more confirmation like um, but Everyone needs to understand and know that there's going to come a time where Jesus is going to have to come and announce no more delay because there's only so God can only wait so long um, before he intervenes and when he know that it's that time and he knows what you know the globalists the elites or whatever um are up to and he knows that this is the time that we have to be out of here he's going to take us out of here so he's not going to allow um things to continue to escalate without removing us he, we have to be removed at some point and Jesus will have to take the scroll and come down and announce no more delay and I believe that will be on the eighth day as well and I just was like wow it's just like the Lord is giving me confirmation after confirmation and you know this is not thus said the Lord I'm just sharing with you guys but I believe the Lord is showing me and what I believe that I'm led to share and my Jesus journey and so you know if you want to watch with me let's watch for our Lord and Savior and if not if you don't like the date setting and you know whatever then you can always just 
dismiss yourself from the channel. Um, I just wanted to share that with you guys because I think that was pretty awesome that he was trying to let me know that this great earthquake was going to happen on the eighth day and I didn't even know what was being you know what he was trying to show me and yeah it's pretty amazing um until next time I love you guys and remember that God loves you more as always I love you guys and remember that God loves you more the ABC salvation is in the description box below this video if you have not accepted Jesus Christ into your life as your Lord and Savior, make the decision to do so now. We are in the final, final seconds, the literal final seconds, before he comes and takes the current day believers. If you die without Jesus in your heart or get the mark of the beast, you will be cast into the lake of fire. Jesus is the only way. There's no other path, no other, nothing else in this world can save you. Jesus Christ is the only way. He's the only one that will save you from what's coming, what's about to come upon this earth. If I don't get to make another video, I hope to see you guys in glory and on the other side. Until next time, you guys stay blessed and shalom.